How's everybody today? Great. All right. How many of you play sports or play sports? And what did y'all do to get better? Practice. All right, practice is a real good answer, but how do you practice is the question. Anybody? Y'all know how y'all practice? Oh. Thank you. Thank you. But there are several ways to practice. You can either run miles, lift weights, or you go to the batting cage or just shoot hoops to you till you can't no more. I do those as well, but how I do it, I have a speed ladder in the cones I use to do footwork drills. What I use, and for my ladder drills, first of all, ladder drills help strengthen the muscle and the nervous system. The point of ladder drill is to step inside the ladder between the runs without your feet touching them. There are 13 speed and agility ladder drills for faster footwork equipment. There's a side step, one step, five hops and run, crossover, side shuttle hop, karaoke, in and out, centipede, icky shuffle, river dance, back and forth, single leg shuffle, and the double trouble. Now for cone drills, cone drills help build leg and strength and explosion on their one, but their intensity is a rep scheme that will change the workload. And they are also an old school stable for speed drills. These drills are very important in sports such as football, basketball, baseball, soccer, tennis, track and field, and many more to go. And these are the top 10 best cone drills for speed and agility. There's the X drill, one, two, three, back, three cones slash the L drill, the pro agility shuttle, run, shuffle, run, cone alley version one, two, and three, stagger shuffle, and the run, shuffle, run. The purpose of these drills is for improvement on speed and agility. Speed and agility training drills are designed to work on your leg and core muscles as well as the tenders in your body. It is important to train at a level that is equal to your game, intensity to help increase your performance and minimize injury. Today with you all, I'm going to share with you a couple of ladder and cone drills and catching the ball. Hi, during these drills, they're all full speed. You need to go hard for it or go home. And let's get better. First off, first off in the ladder drills, I'm gonna show you all the one step. One step is going forward. First up, you get in a position, bend your legs and your knees down. The one leg you push off of, and then your first leg comes in. Now, only one step in each ladder without touching it and catching the ball. But I'm not gonna do that today. The next drill is the, come, the next one is the side step. You face sideways, bend your knees, you look at your toes pointing forward, face wide. Also, you pump, and then you drill, you pump your arms 90 degree angle, then you sprint out. Side step, bend your knees, and then you the one step is first. The foot that's going this facing the ladder goes first, like this. Feet is in each goes in each ladder, going quick. Pump your arms 90 degree angle. Next drill here is the cone drills. First drill is the lateral shuffle. And in your lateral shuffle, you come in, bend your knees, toes point forward, <coughs> your butt low, back straight. You come in, here's how you're doing it. You come in, you shuffle your feet, going straight sideways, pump your arms, 90 degree angle, you spread out. <coughs> Next drill, let me get one more comment for this one, is also the set, is a uh, icky shuffle for cones instead. So you go all together, and come up together, separate, bend your knees, lift forward, toes pointed, back straight, bend your knees, toes forward, back straight, looking forward, how you have a ah, you know what I mean, you got them all positioned forward, by like a little like inch apart, then here you go, then put the feet, pump your arms, now you're going to spread out, get the ball. In my conclusion here, every time I do these drills, they get better, they help better my performance, 
also it gets things off my mind. So whatever best I have in my mind, I leave it out on the field. Also, I put then in the end I put both drills together to strengthen more into my leg and calf muscles. And I can run a little more fast than I did before. Thank you all for letting me demonstrate this today. Hope y'all see me on the field real soon. Thank you very much.